Okay, what's up guys, it's uh, Turner here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you use and install World Guard, but today I have a special guest. Say your name. Wait, I'm sp You're my special I'm guest. I'm special. Yes, he is very special, but, uh, okay, his name is Brain Damage, I don't know if he wants me to use his, his real name, um, but anyway, he's going to help me showcase some of the World Guard features since it's easier with more users, uh, so I can show you some of the other features. So pretty much, uh, you're just going to want to download the plugin here. The dependency on this one is World Edit, so you're going to want to make sure you have that installed as well. Um, I already have both of them installed, and once you have them installed, you just want to start your server. Uh, so just make sure they're in the plugins folder. Now I will leave a link in the description also to the configuration uh, wiki, uh, configuration wiki, to the wiki of World Guard. So this will cover all the commands, all the region, how to define certain regions, how to do a bunch more things with the regions than I'm going to get into, uh, because it would take just so much longer if I was to uh, show you every single thing. Also, uh, I'll leave a link to the flag list, and you'll know more about that later. So pretty much just let's go into I'll start my server up so you can hop on if you'd like. Okay, it's gener it's generating the spawn really quick. Hopefully hey, are you I talking to me? I'm talking to you. Brain oh. damage. Wait. Um, okay. I typed it in. Okay, so just join. Uh, hopefully Okay, so as you see, brain damage has logged on. Should I turn off my- should I get a different skin? Um... <laughs> oh. Okay, so, okay, just wait a second, wait, before you see his skin, I'm gonna- okay, it's pixel- it, it's pixel nudeness, I'll try not to look at him, he's very special sometimes, um, so, anyway, I'll just try- just stand over behind the tree or something for a little bit. <laughs> but we will- we will- we will try to get through this, so, pretty much I'm just gonna make a simple- I'll say this is, I'll make a simple platform, um, I'll be doing a world, uh, edit tutorial, like, god, you really should change your skin. Time um, bomb. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> but, uh, okay, he's behind the tree, okay. So, uh, yeah, so, how we're gonna do this, so this, say this is your spawn, um, say you spawn, I'm not gonna do all this, uh, say you spawn right here in this sand block. This is your spawn, it's nice and fancy, but this is the, this is where you wanna protect it. So, the area you want to protect, so I just want to protect this whole cube, just select the first corner, and then go over here, and we can select the next corner, and that will select that whole uh, square around it. So, once you have that done, you can expand it up or down, or totally vertical. So, usually for a spawn, or for anything that's kind of protected, um, like server, like uh, like a server building, you'd usually want it vertical. Because you, you usually want it vertical because you don't want um, people building over it, like above the uh, the building, dried or underneath it. Uh, so let me I actually better look at that message because my dad's kind of mad at me. Um, oh, never mind. Um, <laughs> but uh, so yeah, so let me just uh, butcher dash dash a. Okay. So yeah, so so are you getting back on? Brain damage. Okay, maybe he'll be back. Well, well, let's hope he'll be back. Otherwise, his that little special guest is useless, right? Huh? Huh? Okay, whatever. Uh, so anyway, I already selected my corners, and I already, or I did not. Um, actually, I'm going to expand vert. So you can either expand uh, vert, which will expand slash slash. Which will expand it totally vertically, or you can type uh, slash slash expand, uh, like say 50 up, and that will expand it from your region only 50 up, or from your selection. And then if you want to do like down, you can do down 50. Uh, also left, right, straight, back, uh, north, south, east, west, I believe work as well. Um, so yeah, so pretty much your, your skin's going to still be the same for me. <laughs> um, uh, I don't think so. Yeah, because I never updated my uh, thing. So just we'll just forewarn, be forewarned of this skin. Um, he's got a little problem. Uh, but anyway, so no, we're gonna we're gonna define don't this. Forewarn, it's funny. Okay, we're gonna define this region right now. Uh, so if you are new to region or you're creating a region, you just do slash region or slash rg uh, define 
and then space the name and of course he's walking in my view so I guess you see him right now uh, so just region defined and let's say spawn so I'm making a spawn so this now this whole region was a spawn and as you can see now he can't build so try to play something down I already did and what does it say you can't build it Tuh, tuh, tuh. So yeah, cause you're a faggot. <laughs> so as you see, it automatically turns off building. Um, so build to deny. Walk over here. Come over here. Or go outside. Come over here. Come over here. Come on. Now just destroy some grass. Okay. So you see how we can build in there, but he can't build in there. So that's just a similar example. Uh, so if you, there are a whole bunch of flags, which that's what I'll be talking about now. Uh, right here and these can be just you can enable or disable certain things So say you don't want PvP to be disabled or mob damage or mob spawning or creeper explosion There's a whole list here, but I'm gonna show you how to add one because it, it works for everyone and you can just look in the list here um, To find the one that is uh, best suits you so say I don't want PvP to be enabled because right now if I type uh, I Type this I can hit him or her um. <laughs> so uh, if I type slash RG or region space uh, Got my flag your dad's home great uh, region flag and then the name so spawn and then whatever flag you'd like to do so let's do PvP uh, deny we well, don't need a capital D so PvP deny that will deny uh, player access to PvP um, so they will not be able to kill anybody or hit anybody so I'll teleport him up here to show you that so as you see no PvP in this area um, so you can do multiple uh, so instead of PvP you could do like um, build uh, if you don't want like nether or not nether porters uh, ender pearls ender pearls so you can basically just deny that so as you saw earlier um, that's how you add a region but you saw earlier that he could not build in this region now I'm going to show you how you add him to that region. So uh, let's say that uh, this is a plot or you want to add. Uh, you want to add some more players to this region so they can build. Or say it's a plot, uh, maybe they donate, you want to know how to add them. Or maybe they just get it in game and you want to know how to add them. So pretty much how you add them, it's very simple. It should do slash region. Uh, region add owner space the name so spawn. And then the name, so brain damage. So now I, the region spawn is updated. Now if he comes on here, he should be able to build. So play something. Right click. You can you not build? <laughs> okay, I guess I guess he cannot build. Add owner, spawn brain damage thirty six. Yeah. So let me let me add him to a member as well. Uh, dun, dun, dun. Okay, now try. Nope. Okay, get out of my freaking view, Jesus. So usually you'll type add. I don't know what that is. Maybe it's something. You'll type just region add owner, and then it will allow uh, them to build or allow them to do whatever they need. Um, so I don't see why that's not working. It might just be a bug with my version. Uh. But usually that's that's how you would do it normally. So I'll, I'll go over here and I'll make a new one just to see if it's just that one. I'll just do right here. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Okay, come over here. Of course. You go AFK. Okay, come over here. Now try to destroy a block down there. There you go. So now he can destroy a block. So I added him to order. Maybe I didn't capitalize uh, the T. No, I did. Uh, but anyway, as you see there, he can build. So if you're going to add an owner, I guess right now, um, add him directly through the, if you create a region flag. So 
just create one. Um, so I'm defining a region right here. So region defines space test. And then right after that, uh, you can add the owner's name or the owner of that region's name. And if you need to add multiple, just put a comma and then the other name. So magic man out of two. And I will add, well, that region's already defined. Uh, but that will basically show you what you can do. So that's, that's it for that aspect. I can also do uh, slash slay brain damage, which will... Murder him. My dad is so annoying. <laughs> I didn't even like. He's calling me a little faggot earlier. Um, Go away, <laughs> dad. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> but okay. So I guess I guess you can kind of hear me. But anyway, that is pretty much um all I'm gonna show you because that is the gist of it. I don't want this tutorial to be any longer than ten minutes because that is fairly long. Uh, but now what you can do is you can create more regions, you can add um, certain flags, so here's a huge flag list. And if you need to add, like, if you if you have any questions on a region, just go here, hit Control F. Uh, say you want to know how to create a region, just type, just type create. It'll say all the, it'll say everything that has the word created in it. So creating, create region with region defined city, and that will show you how if you need help. Um, also, I will show you if you if your server's lagging or somebody somebody spawns a big thing of TNT or a whole bunch of lava is spawning or falling, you can type slash uh, stop lag, and that will halt all intensive server activity. And how you enable that again is uh, stop lag space dash C, and that will enable it. You can also disable and allow fire. So uh, say fire spreading, I can stop fire. Action loss, fire. <laughs> That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> my bad. Okay, I gotta start. I gotta set the server up again. That was an epic fail on my part. Hey, what's this even about? What are this, you teaching this is, me? This, I'm not teaching I you mean, anything. It's, it's not for you. Um, but just do one minute. Stop fire, and that will stop the global fire spread. And if you want to allow it, just allow fire. So and that will that will be the basic command. The, the, what I just did is I stopped the server and gave <laughs> the message fire. So um, if I do slash stop again, which I'm not gonna, the name it will just say it'll stop the server with name. So if I want to say restarting now, uh, it will say that. Uh, so Ready anyway, starting. Thank you for watching. Now, now I'll see you guys later.